What's up guys, Krogs here, and this is going to be a video on how to create custom set pieces, and not too many people know how to do this on FIFA, so I'm going to show you how to get there first. You just go to Skill Games and then Practice Arena. From here, you just press the back or select button, depending on what console you are, and then just go to Create Set Piece, and then you're going to have the option to choose the region where you want to do your set piece, and for this one, we're just going to be doing corner set pieces. So what you're going to do from here, you're going to go to Create New Set Piece, and then with your players you can move them wherever you want and then to run paths you just press B and then record basically where you want your player to move what you want them to do so obviously you're not going to do something like this I already have a set piece made I'm just showing you guys uh, that you can run these paths and it's pretty simple to make so let's get let's get into the set piece that I've created so just go to edit existing and then I've been making this set piece since FIFA 10 or FIFA 11 and it's extremely effective. It's been really effective on FIFA 13 as well so if you guys want to make something similar to this uh, feel free to do so. These three players back here are just to prevent a counter attack from happening in case the play doesn't end up working. Uh, the guy right here he's going to receive the pass and then I'm going to run with him either between these two defenders or below this guy and it's gonna draw both of those players and I'm gonna pass up to this guy usually around here he gets the pass and then it's an open shot almost every time and usually not every time it's a goal but a lot of the times it's a pretty good scoring chance this guy right here uh, I just run basically into the corner to draw one or two defenders away clearing out the middle uh, kind of the same purpose with this guy to clear out the middle and he also is here to get a rebound uh, whoops, same guy right here just getting a rebound clear in the middle and this guy again getting the rebound in case uh, the keeper saves it so that's the set piece I've created gonna get into some examples uh, showing you guys how effective it is there's some different variations which I'll also explain so uh, I'll get into examples right now one thing I forgot to mention is that you have to create the set piece on this side as well if you want to use it in game. So I started the video showing you guys what I had up here and now I'm going to show you what I have created on this side. It's basically the same thing, uh, same idea with the players uh, clearing out the middle. So I have the players up here who are clearing out the middle and then passing to the bottom player over here and then he's going to pass to this guy. So it's basically the same concept and we're going to get into the examples right now. Alright, we're getting into some examples showing how this play works and something I want to point out is that Messi is taking the shot and he's the striker on the pitch so you want to make sure if you're using Barcelona as your practice squad make sure he's the one taking the shot because in your game when you're using this play you want your striker to be the one who's taking the shot. That's something that, I'm, that maybe people will make the mistake of putting like a defender as the person taking the shot and obviously that's not going to make the play very effective if you're having someone with a low shot rating uh, taking the shot. So just I showed the example from one side of the pitch and here it is from the other side. Like I said while I was showing the play set up, I'm basically drawing these two defenders towards me and then finessing it to the far post. So pretty good for an open shot. It works a lot of the time. And you can also do different variations. So I just pass it straight to Messi. If your opponent is kind of reading it, if you get a lot of corners in the game and you're passing to that first guy, maybe he'll bring in a third defender. So you might want to mix it up and just pass straight to the player who's taking the shot. And I found it's not as effective, so you might not want to start off in your game doing this. But if he does bring a third guy, I do suggest trying this out. And if you're a player who likes going for some crazy shots, you can always cross it to the first uh, player like this. Sometimes he attempts a bicycle kick. So there's some pretty cool goal opportunities, but this video is basically wrapping up. If you guys want to leave this video a like, we really would appreciate that. And if you're new to our channel, feel free to subscribe. We're always going to be bringing tons of FIFA content. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Hopefully it helped you out, and I'll talk to you guys later.